Congratulations, you started your business. But what is next? Hey everyone, I'm John Timmerman. I talk about the world's most exciting sales, marketing, and business strategies so that both you and I can grow our businesses better. Today we are talking about what to do right after you start your business. So whatever start your business means uh, for you, it in context of this video, it is right after you actually set up your ability to take money and perform some action, whether it's sending products or doing a service. That's what I mean by starting a business. But what is the very next thing you do and what does the next process look like? Well, the next most important thing for every business is to get customers. It's the first most important thing, not the organization, not detailing out the business plan. It is getting customers. Even if you need to raise money, raising money is going to be a lot easier if you get customers. And if you can't get customers, you can check out my other video uh, that I filmed about the first three things to do uh, for a business with no funding. But even if you can't actually sell a product yet, you can pre-sell it. You can get validation. So watch that video on validation. But the first thing you should do is sell your products or sell your services. And one of the easiest ways to do this is to start working for free. I know it's counterproductive. You're like, what? I just started a business. I want to make money. Well, the easiest way to make money is to show people that whatever your is you're offering is valuable. And the easiest way to get that message across is to show that other people like it. So if you have a product, let people try it for free and leave good reviews. If you have a product that you can give away for free, give away the product for free, let people try it and get good reviews. Have them film a video testimonial, have them leave you five-star reviews on Amazon or Google or wherever it might be. Get that validation, right? So working for free, sending your products for free, uh, or letting people try your products for free is the best way to get some momentum and social proof. Then you can leverage that social proof into actual paid customers. You can do the same thing on the service side. If you're starting a landscape company, go mow lawns for free and collect testimonials. Take pictures with people and how happy they are with your freshly cut lawn. And then use that to go to other customers and say, look what I did for this person. Look how happy they are. Post it on Facebook. Put it on Reddit. Put it on Instagram. Put it on LinkedIn. Put it everywhere you possibly can. Send it to friends and texts and emails and DMs. Getting the social proof is the first most important step for most businesses out there because it will provide leverage to get actual paid work. That is the first thing you should do right after starting your business. Hey, if you found this video helpful or you know somebody who would find it helpful, please help me out and share this video. You can text it to your friends. You can post it on LinkedIn. You can tweet about it. You can send it in an email. If you can think of somebody who just started their business or they're thinking about starting their business, forward it to them. Hopefully it helps them get their first paid gig. Thanks a lot. See you in the next video.